You brought this upon yourself, Frieza. Though I have to admit, I didn't see it ending quite like this. Cuz you saying? Uh... I'm going to make my way back to Earth. You can stay here and suffer the same fate as this planet. I thank you. P please have mercy. Please have mercy. I thank you. How can you beg for mercy? How many people begged you for mercy before you slaughtered them? How many? I beg. I've given you just a little bit of my energy. That's all you get. You're on your own. <laughs> you the greatest being in the universe. And that is why you, you must, you must die by my hand! You fool! Curse him! Curse that wretched Saiyan! The mortal enemies known as Frieza and Goku had once fought to the death on the planet Namek. During their epic showdown, Goku's anger triggered something. It awakened the Super Saiyan transformation, which helped him defeat the terrible tyrant, Frieza. With Goku having defeated Frieza, it was believed the two fighters would never again cross one another's paths. But that was not the case. Having been brought back to life with the use of Earth's Dragon Balls, Frieza lived once again. He now sought vengeance against the Saiyan who'd humiliated him. Determined to exact his revenge, Frieza gathered his forces, also brought back using the Dragon Balls, and set out to accomplish his new mission. In preparation for the battle, Frieza subjected himself to intense training and attained immense power. Mere moments before the Frieza Force were to arrive on Earth. <laughs> the time for vengeance has finally arrived. Now then, let's pay Goku's beloved Earth a visit, shall we? Goku and Vegeta continue their own intense training under the watchful eyes of Whis on Beerus' planet. The two warriors are eager to push the Super Saiyan God form to even greater heights. <sighs> <sighs> I believe that will do for today. I must say, you two have made considerable progress with respect to movement, but your speed still needs work. Still needs work? You're still relying far too much on your head. This habit is especially strong with you, Vegeta. <laughs> you really do like to overthink everything, Vegeta. Shut up! You're only thinking less because you're an idiot! Perhaps you've noticed, but you always manage to be one step behind Goku. Do you know why that is? You're far too tense, making it more difficult for you to fight at your full potential. You need to relax more, like Goku. You just had to bring that up, didn't you? Goku, you, on the other hand, are overconfident. Let your focus waver and you're doomed to fail. What? We'll work on conquering these shortcomings of yours as we continue your training. All right. Just gotta focus. Focus, focus, focus. Well, I think that's enough rest for now, wouldn't you agree? Shall we continue your training? Yeah. As the two of you have unique needs in your training, what do you say we do this one at a time? You got it. You know, I actually prefer doing it this way. <laughs> You won't get any complaints from me. Oh my, you two really don't get along, do you? I can't imagine why that is. Now then, let's start things off with you, Goku. 
Woohoo! Too bad for you, Vegeta. <laughs> Makes no difference. Go ahead, I'm gonna surpass you anyway. I'm impressed with your performance, Goku. You seem capable of visualizing that which lies beyond Super Saiyan God. Yeah, I think I can figure out the rest on my own. Thanks, Whis. On to the next task. Now we need to ensure that we can bring Vegeta up to your level. After all, it's absolutely paramount that both of you increase your strength and power right now. Right. Couldn't agree more. And I think Vegeta's gonna be just fine. He'll probably master this new power in no time. He's just that good, you know? Well done, Vegeta. Color me impressed. You call yourself a genius, and I dare say it's not mere hubris. <laughs> I still haven't reached yours or Lord Beerus's level. I won't be satisfied until I do. You always have your nerves wound up in a bunch. This tension will prevent you from acting when you need to most. Find a way to conquer this shortcoming, and you'll no doubt push your godly power even further than you thought possible. <laughs> Once you're ready to resume your training, please promise to come and find me immediately. Fine, I've got it. Goku and Vegeta, more determined than ever to push themselves even further, continued their training with Whis. In the end, the two Saiyans had managed to successfully achieve a wonderful and new power. You're both here. Excellent. Yep, let's get right into it while it's all still fresh in my mind. The time has come to find out if you've actually attained a power that goes beyond a god, Kakarot. <laughs> I very much look forward to seeing the fruits of your labor, gentlemen. This form takes a lot out of you, even more than Super Saiyan God. It's probably because we've become Super Saiyans while in our godlike state. Still, this power is incredible. Hmm. Look at that. Your efforts have finally paid off. Whew. Though, it looks like we can't stay in this form for very long. Which means we haven't completely mastered it yet. You two have really surprised me. I must admit, I wasn't expecting you to reach this level in such a short period of time. You know, I'm pretty surprised too, if I'm honest. I had no idea I could go beyond Super Saiyan God. <laughs> You're not the only one who pulled it off. Seems your days at the top might be numbered. Indeed. You two have both managed to become Super Saiyans with the power of Super Saiyan Gods! Hmm, that's a rather cumbersome way of putting it. Let's see, your hair becomes blue while in this form, so perhaps Super Saiyan Blue would be more suitable. Super Saiyan Blue, huh? That'll be easy to remember. Now that you've achieved this power, I think all that remains is to put said power to the test. I want you to engage me in battle using all of your power. Up for it? This should help you come to terms with your new form. All right, let's do this! <laughs> Magnificent! Well now, let's begin. Now, now, you two, this is certainly not the time to squabble. I expect this some more time for you. More attacks are better than I expected. This is great. I think I'm getting the hang of it. This is wonderful! You've advanced so much in my completely 
training different people. Fascinating. What do you say we conclude the training session here? You two are phenomenal. It seems the Super Saiyan Blue form is becoming second nature to the pair of you. Should the two of you learn to work together, I dare say you could possibly go toe-to-toe -to -toe with even the likes of Lord Beerus. Whoa, really? Well, to tell you the truth, I'd much rather fight him by myself. Huh. I'm the one taking Lord Beerus down, and I'll do it without your help. Oh, bother. This intense rivalry between you two is proving most troublesome. So, Whis, could you maybe train me some more? I really want to master this Super Saiyan Blue power. <laughs> it would be my pleasure. What? I'm not going to let you hog all of Whis's time. I'm training too! Uh, at least you two see eye to eye on something. Very well. Let's press onward, shall we? Yeah. <laughs>